Well, I grew up in Limerick and as an undergraduate I decided to study physical education and maths teaching. I was always more interested in the mathematics side of the teaching and um, I was commonly asked by the kids I was teaching, why do we need to use this technique or what's the point in learning this, can you give me a real life example? And it is probably the most common question maths teachers are always asked. So um, when I decided to go on to do further studies I tried to find a course that would help me understand how maths was used in everyday life. So after searching through different perspectives and stuff I found a MSc in Mathematical Modelling in UL. A Master's in Mathematical Modelling uh, gives each student an insight into how mathematics is used in the real world. Um, we study different models and how these models examine a certain process and help, um, help the student get, uh, find predictions about how a, def a certain outcome of a process will happen. Um, basically, when we first come in, you learn different techniques in the background modules such as fluid mechanics, um, asymptotics, learn techniques such as non-dimensionalization. All of these techniques give you the foundation to become a good modeler and to be able to tackle problems to do with real life processes. Once we learn the foundation techniques, we can begin to study actual different models. There's, of course, just mathematical modeling, um, mathematical biology, mathematical geoscience, where we study all the different models in the real world and break them down mathematically so we can gain a prediction. We started off with basic models such as a swinging pendulum and then gradually developed to more and more complicated models such as electric propagation down a nerve cell or the formation of sand dunes in the desert. Um, the models we study currently at the moment in the MSc are very relevant to what goes on in the real world. We, um, we have to undertake many projects that are often scaled down versions of real projects that have been undertaken by the Maxi Group at the moment. Well personally I'm going to get back involved in education and use the skills I've learned here to become a better teacher. Um, there's also the option of getting involved in industry. We've had plenty of practice of uh, modeling industrial processes throughout the year and there's also the possibility of going on further studies doing a PhD.